You've seen these ads. I've seen these ads. Zero code. Build apps with no code. Sounds magical. But every time I hear it, the less I believe it. So today, I'm putting these zero code platforms to the test. No developer knowledge, no coding background. Just me, acting as the most clueless beginner possible. If it's really beginner friendly, I should be able to use it without Googling anything. Introducing the twist, code flying. Then I found this platform claiming something bold. Code flying, zero barriers, anyone can build an app. Sure, and I'm the CEO of Google. The more a platform repeats zero code, the more suspicious I get. So let's see how real this claim is. Step one, idea and prompt entry. I log in and instead of a complicated dashboard, it gives me a simple box, just a text box, no panels, no logic diagrams, no code previews. Just describe your app. Fine, let's start with something basic. I type, I want a simple reward app with dark mode, round buttons, a point system, and emoji style text. One sentence. Step two, AI analysis and automatic app generation. Now the platform starts working. No coding UI, no code blocks. The AI analyzes the idea, decides the layout, the backend, the structure, and starts generating the whole thing automatically. Then the preview loads, a working app layout with real navigation, with actual UI, with functioning backend logic, all from one sentence. I actually sat back thinking, wait, did it really just make an app? Step three, interactive preview and real-time changes. Okay, fine, maybe it can do the basics. Let's push it. I start throwing random beginner level demands at it. Switch everything to dark mode, done. Make the buttons rounder, done. Add a point system, done. Backend logic appears on its own. Turn all text into emoji tone, done. Add animations, done. Add a new screen for user rewards, sure. Make the design more aesthetic, instant refresh. Every change updates in real time. No code, no design tools, no logic diagrams. Just me talking to it like I'm texting a friend. Step four, finalize and publish. Here's where it gets wild. Code flying doesn't just generate the app. It also builds a full supporting management system for it. My data is stored automatically. I can monitor app information 24 seven, user data, points, interactions, updates. Everything is organized and ready. And I still haven't touched code. Publishing is also literally one click, instant H5 web page, and they're adding one click iOS and APK packaging soon. No setup, no certificates, no complicated exporting, just publish and open. And the final product works on browser and mobile, like a real dev team built it. Step five, showcase the final product. I actually built a functional app with customization, with interactive features, with UI changes, with dark mode, with a point system, with multiple screens, and I didn't touch code, not even by accident, just English instructions and clicks, light sarcasm and thoughtful ending. So is zero code a scam? Some platforms definitely make it feel like one, but code flying? This thing actually shut me up. And here's the crazy part. I never saw a single line of code from start to finish, and I didn't have to write any code at all. Maybe zero code isn't fake. Maybe we just misunderstood it. Maybe the whole point of technology is to let normal people build things without needing a computer science degree. After today, one thing is clear. Beginner-friendly tools do exist. And this one feels real. If you're skeptical like I was, go try it. See if you can break it. See if you can expose the truth. Honestly, I thought I was going to roast this platform, but instead it roasted me by actually working.